course, the ladies won't tee things up for real to Jamie Farr until tomorrow morning. But that doesn't mean that Highland Meadows is not a very busy place. Today, the media got to talk to all the big stars. Howard Chen joins us live from Highland Meadows. And Howie, understand the defending champ is hurting a little bit. Yeah, you know, it's always like a really, really nice day here at the FAR. Action starts tomorrow like you were talking about, but there's some action today because Paula Creamer, the big news is that she might not even play tomorrow. I mean, she's defending champ. You may recall last year she dominated. She shot a tournament record 60 in the first round. It's pretty much game over after that. But like I said, she might not be back to defend her title. The Pink Panther might not be back for the tournament with the Pink Panther as a mascot. Now, she did play the Celebrity Pro-Am today, the 18 holes there, and she did tee off yesterday for about 15 minutes off the driving range. She putted all week long, but she has this thumb injury that she suffered at last week's Wegmans LPGA tournament. She took a quarter zone shot on a Monday, but she's seeing a doctor tomorrow, and it all depends on that, whether or not she'll make the decision to actually play tomorrow. It's It just depends. Uh, it was I can't practice, but you know we'll see. Um, I feel I just I hope I can make the right decision for for me tomorrow. You know, feel like you're defending a tournament, but at the same time, it's difficult when you have a an injury. And we'll have more on this story later tonight at 10 o'clock, and then we'll also have more from the far later on in this show. Live from Highland Meadows, I'm Howard Chen for Fox Little News. First at four.